वेलकम टू बूस्ट सेशन गाइस प्लीज सब्सक्राइब इफ यू हैवन एंड दिस इज अ स्पेशल एडिशन फॉर विंडोज ओएस एंड टुडे विल बी कन्वर्टिंग ओप्पो और रियल मी स्टॉक रिकवरी और जिप फाइल टू कस्टम रिकवरी फ्लैशेबल जिप फाइल ओके द स्पॉटेड डिवाइस लिस्ट फॉर और जिप टू जिप कन्वर्जन विल बी देयर इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन नाउ फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू नीड टू इंस्टॉल Ubuntu इन विंडोज एंड द इंस्टॉलेशन लिंक विल बी गिवन इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन I mean the video link. The download size for that is 278 MB, and after installation, it will take around 879 MBs of your disk space. Now just directly navigate to your start and type Ubuntu, and you will see it right here. Right click on it, run as administrator, and click on yes. Now just run these commands one by one into the terminal. Type your password. Press enter. First of all you need to update Ubuntu all right now type the second command make sure you are connected to the internet here you should type y and then press enter it's going to download all the packages now wait until it has got finished installing so when this screen comes you should go to the yes and press enter now after it's got successfully completed launch these last three commands one by one also just copy them and right click here and paste them and press enter it's already installed so we don't have to install it again same for the rest two also you need to copy them twice and paste it here and press enter now type y and press enter you better have a good internet connection to make it fast now they are getting installed and now it's about to complete now we have to execute the last command also copy it twice paste it here and press enter it will take a while and it is getting downloaded now it's installing the package and it also got successfully installed now the main thing starts type cd space forward slash and enter now type cd space mnt now type ls now we have four drives c d e n g okay so i have placed the files in the d drive let me show you in here in the d drive i have a folder named ozip okay so in there i have placed these four files out of which one is the ozip file as here you can see the ozip format it's right here okay and these two files which are required for the conversion just download them from the description link will be provided now here you can see that it's d o zip so we will be just typing cd space d forward slash o zip and press enter okay and now to list the files press ls and press enter now we have all these files after that just copy this command from here until this okay not after that now after this command you need to type the name of this file the complete file name press control c to copy and right click to paste it okay so now we have this complete command just press enter to begin the conversion and it's decrypting in windows earlier video was shown for linux but now it's working in windows okay it will take a while let's see if the file is there yeah it is right there it got converted okay so just press enter there and it's already done you need to just press enter once okay try to look into this folder when you see a file name same with this and the size is also same then you need to press enter here and you will see a done option here okay sometimes it doesn't shows done here so now you can open this file and here it is okay so we have successfully converted o zip file to the decrypted zip file okay thank you for watching now it's time to discover more simply click on the screen to subscribe to our channel and watch another video to discover more